which figure measurements can be challenging. Hi, my name is Ed Hennickel, and I'd like to give you several hints to make successful noise figure measurements. The first hint demonstrates the importance of selecting the best noise source to reduce measurement uncertainties. Agilent offers two families of noise sources, the traditional 346 series and the newer smart noise source that automatically downloads calibration data into the instrument. Both families offer a 6 dB model and a 15 dB model. In this setup we're going to be measuring the noise figure of this amplifier using both our 6 dB and 15 dB smart noise source connected to the PXA signal analyzer and the embedded noise figure application. Let's first make the measurement with the 6 dB noise source. We can minimize errors by using the 6 dB noise source which has a smaller and therefore more linear detector range. As you can see the measurement on the right is about 0.4 to 0.5 dB higher than the measurement on the left. The right hand measurement was made using a 15 dB noise source and the measurement on the left was made using a 6 dB noise source. In summary, it's important to select the correct noise source to minimize measurement errors. As a general rule, use the 6 dB noise source when making noise figure measurements up to 15 dB. You can get more information about Agilent's noise figure solutions by reviewing our noise figure selection guide which can be found at the URL below. I also encourage you to review the 10 hints for making successful noise figure measurement application note. Thanks for watching.